Hey guys, welcome back to Living Live with MB Gal. We're just outside No Frills and we got a shit groceries for freezer meal. We're gonna show you a little bit later, but that's just my box of meat alone. I think we each got like 20 peppers or something like that crazy. Whole bag full of peppers. And we got Amanda and she's got her van and we're gonna load up and show you guys what we got here in a few. But uh, we're gonna do some freezer meal preps. Put the meat in there for me. Oh. Slide the big boxes in anyways. All right, so we'll catch you back here. We'll probably go to Walmart next. We'll see you in there. There we go, guys. We just made her at a Walmart. We got five Tides, some Unstoppables, and a $9 bathing suit. We'll catch you back. We're going to Costco next. Hey guys, it's Live and Large with MB Gal. I just got back with my good friend, um, Amanda, and we hit up some stores. We went first to No Frills, then to Walmart, then to Olson's, which is a little meat market, and then to Costco. So I'll show you what I picked up at No Frills. Now, No Frills had their ribs on sale. I believe they're $2.99 a pound we're doing all this with freezer meals so i'll show you guys this um now keep in mind we're not hoarding or anything like this we're actually using all of this for the month to make some freezer meals so i'm doubling a batch um i'm ma making ribs so these are about 10 12 dollars a pack got some ziploc bags for freezing the meals got some um chicken breast uh, 30% off that pack and the other pack was like uh, I think nine dollars I needed six things of hamburger now this is just it's upside down it's just regular hamburger but um, it's fine for the freezer meals we're doing that was like ten dollars a pack these packs of stew meat were all 30% off so they're about thirteen dollars for a double pack so I got four of those Pork tenderloins were also on sale, 30% uh, off. So up here it was $8.55 for this one. It was also 30% off. And this one was 30% off, that's $9.81. One of my recipes calls for lasagna noodles. So I got two of those. I think it was a pizza casserole. I needed an extra fajita mix. I needed three more Alfredo, so I just got whatever different ones there's going in this basically in the same one something in the states that people have access to that we don't too much is rotel because i needed the green chilies we couldn't find green chilies so we got two cans of that these are just for tonight to go with salad some croutons i got some soy sauce got some sweet and sour and honey garlic sauce and I got all of these peppers. I needed 20 peppers. And I got some oranges. <clears throat> I think, oh, and the big thing of blueberries for $5. And this great big thing of oil back here was $7.99, one liter of oil. Now, if I move on to Walmart, I got myself a bathing suit. If it doesn't fit me, if it's too big, it can always fit um, Nevea. It's really nice, like a tie dye. A 2x so if it doesn't fit me that's fine um so that was at walmart and um let's see what else we got four jugs one for brady for all his clothes and his bedding and the other three didn't really matter these were 6.97 i did get an a downy kind of like unstoppables this one's in the woodland rain scent and so at no frills, if I go back, I spent $246.36. And at Walmart, I had got a water as well. And the bathing suit, so that came to 56. 
Then I went to Olson's, which is just a little meat market, and they had basically three or two and a half dozen peewee eggs for $2.99, which is an awesome deal because eggs up here are $4 for regular eggs, I would say. We also went to Costco and I got buttery steakhouse um, seasoning and some sweatpants for the littles. So this is the Kinder's Buttery Steakhouse Seasoning. I use this stuff in everything. Highly, highly recommend. It, it, it does tend to be a seasonal item. So if you don't get it now at Costco, you probably won't get it. And the sweatpants, I did pick them up something for back to school. I know I told you guys I wasn't going to, but these are for Brady. It's just some bench sweatpants. And these are for Chloe. Looks like that. So, that's all for now, guys. We are going to the United States, to Calus, Maine tomorrow. I will take some shots of that and where we put it all, okay? So, thanks for uh, spending the afternoon with us and see you tomorrow.